Hey guys, I got a new video for you today and we're going to be taking a look at a new knife that I just received. Now this knife was actually featured in one of Cutlery Lover's latest videos. Um, if you guys follow Jeff, he is a great guy. He's one of the OG uh, YouTube knife reviewers and gear reviewers. And I've actually been following him for years, uh, ever since I started here on YouTube, so well over 10 years. So when I saw him feature this knife, um, I knew that basically whatever he said was pretty much um, you know, right on, on the money as far as the knife goes. So I decided to go ahead and pick it up. Uh, also primarily because this knife um, ticked or checked off a lot of different boxes for me as far as different firsts. So uh, this is obviously by a company called Real Steel. Now this is my first Real Steel knife. And this one here is the Megalodon and that is in the M390 blade steel. Now this is also my first M390 knife. I actually don't own any knives with that steel. And this particular one is actually one of 200, so this one is number 102. Now this one is available from Indiana Knives. It's a knife company, so I'll leave a, um, a link to their site if you guys are interested. And the last thing is that when he posted his video, this knife was actually going for $169.99. And when I went onto the website, it's actually dropped. So it's, you can have this knife for $149.99. And I think for $149, um, even for the $169 or you know the original price, uh, $189 or something like that, it's a great knife. Now, this isn't going to be a full-blown review on this knife. I will leave a link to just video if you guys are interested. Um, uh, or you guys can you know visit the site itself and check it out. But I would definitely recommend that if you like what you see here in my video or even in Jeff's video, that you you know hurry and go pick it up because again, it is limited to only 200 pieces. So if you like it and you know um, you know, you don't want to miss out on it. So again, this is by Real Steel. Now this is the Megalodon, the Micarta uh, edition. They do have um, other editions, but this one is Micarta. So uh, I also really like Micarta, but I just don't seem to find a lot of knives that I like with the Micarta, Micarta handle. So again, another box that this checked off that I, you know, obviously made it a lot easier to purchase the knife. So when you get it, um, this is what you're gonna get. First things first, um, this was an awesome touch. This is a the business card for Indiana Knives, and it actually says, thanks, Lewis, right there. So they personalized it, which is really cool. Um, here's their information if you guys are interested, and then um, some of the different brands that they carry. They threw in this, uh, this magnet, so that's pretty cool. Um, Indiana Knives magnet. And they also have a little sticker here, Indiana Knives. And then what's really cool is that they also have another sticker that has the actual knife on it. So that is really, really cool. Um, so if you guys pick up the Megalodon, then you might get one of these stickers with the Megalodon on there. So that was really cool also. So you do get this uh, insert, and this just talks about some of the different um, uh, exploded views of some of their knives. And then you do get a certificate of authenticity. Again, this is the Megalodon exclusive. Blade material, material M390, the blade length is 3.94 inches, so almost a four inch blade, which is really cool, really cool because it's a nice and larger size knife. Blade finish is satin. Again, the handle material is titanium and micarta, and the um, date of birth is October of 2021, and this one is number 102 of 200. So that is um, all the rest of the stuff that's in the box. And then underneath here, the knife has actually came wrapped in this cloth. And here it is. So again, this is um, like a brown colored micarta. Um, really nice to the touch. As you guys can see, there is a little bit of a different color right here around the pivot. And then it's a little bit lighter down here. It is a flipper knife and it flips out very effortlessly and really, really awesome. So I like the fact that the show side here is kind of sterile, so nothing on the blade. And then you just have the kind of micarta on this side. And then on the opposite side, you do have the titanium, um, which is nice. You do have a lock bar stabilizer here and a really interesting cutout that they did. So just kind of going straight down and made this like kind of wave in the titanium there, which is pretty interesting. Your pocket clip. Uh, one thing is uh, I just kind of used to deep right pocket clips so i almost wish that it had a, a deep right clip on there but again because of the size you know um you know you, you do have to have some drawbacks there but um you know deeper right clip would have been nice you do have real steel on the clip right there very very comfortable 
um, and it secures it really nice. Nice and firm lock up and it fits really, really nice in my hands there. On the opposite side of the blade here, you do have design by Carson H and then the number. So this is number 102. Hopefully you guys can make it out there. 102 right there. And then on the bottom of the flipper right here, you do have M390, which is the blade steel. So um, if you disengage the lock, it actually closes very, very nicely, very smooth. Now, obviously this came razor sharp, um, hair popping sharp right out of the box. Uh, like I mentioned, this is my first experience with M390. Um, I, I've only had this knife for about two days now, so I haven't really been able to actually EDC it just yet, but I am gonna put it into my rotation because I just I just think it's really, really awesome. So as I mentioned, this isn't gonna be a full-blown review. It's just gonna be a quick, quick kind of look at it, but it is a larger size knife with that um, almost four inch blade, 3.9 inches. And I think it's coming in, um, almost four ounces, I think 3.9 something um, ounces. So, um, you know, it's, it's not the lightest knife, but again, it's a, it's a larger size knife, but really, really comfortable in the hand, uh, especially with that micarta side and then the titanium side on the other. Um, obviously, flow through design, uh, no lanyard hole, but what you do have is you have this um, kind of uh, barrel spacer there, I guess, or uh, where you can actually um, fit the lanyard in there and it rotates a little bit. So um, if you wanted to kind of hang down or something like that, you can go ahead and do that. And then that's right in between those two standoffs there. Uh, again, a lock up is nice and tight and then disengaging the lock the blade falls right into the handle right there. So um, again, if you like what you see, um, I would definitely, definitely recommend that you don't sleep on it. Check out the link that I'll leave below. I'm not getting anything on it, just uh, wanted to pass it on to you guys the same way that Jeff Cutlery Lover kind of passed it on to the rest of us. And I went ahead and took advantage of that and picked up a really awesome knife. So again, it's uh, as of the filming of this video, today is December 17th. It's on their site for $149.99. I think you really, really cannot beat that price, especially on a knife of this quality. So there it is. Uh, let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.